So this is David Potts coming at you. So as I record this, it is the final days of 2016, and I wanted to do a quick just uh, State of the Union, talk about where things are, look back at the year and what I've accomplished with this channel, and uh, also look ahead to 2017 with some goals I have. Gonna keep this short. The big story for me with this channel and this project in 2016 was, 2016 was the year I started making videos again. For a really quick history of this channel, um, I started my website, Song Notes, back in 2012, and I was focused on the web 100%, right? Built that up, added a few songs to the website each week. This is all text-based stuff, tabs and everything. Um, and about a year later, 2013, November, December, I discovered that YouTube is an awesome place for guitar videos and decided, hey, I should try making some videos. I had the software, I've made some videos for other things in the past. So at the time, I spent a couple weeks making a few videos each week. So I made videos as you see here. And uh, I learned a lot very quickly. Um, I learned what kind of videos people watched more of and which people, which videos people weren't as interested in. Um, I learned about lighting and sound and audio. It's all kinds of complicated production stuff that I had never really sort of thought about before. And also um, it taught me how fun and challenging it was to fully learn the songs and put together a lesson in a way that would be helpful for you all to sort of watch and, and learn from. So all that aside, it was a fun little month or two sort of side project at the time. Put together these videos. Um, some of them went on to get a lot of hits, which was really, really cool to see. But then I stopped, I stopped making the videos. And uh, since then I haven't really been doing much as far as uh, making videos at all, which is weird because it was earlier in 2016 when I was really into the ukulele and I started learning these songs and uh, ended up looking at my phone, realizing that I had this camera that was good enough to record decent, you know, decent video and ended up recording, doing a few different uh, playthroughs of songs I had learned. One of the reasons I did this just was to prove to myself, hey, I actually learned these songs and here's what it sounds like when I learned them. And maybe later I can uh, go back and look at these videos and remind myself of how I played each song, right? And that's really the spirit of why I started Song Notes in the first place was I love playing guitar, I love learning songs, but what happens is you learn a song and then you move on to new songs and that original song you learn kind of forget, you forget it, right? It goes away in your memory. And that can be quite maddening, right? Uh, so you could write it down, you could type it up, um, or you could record a video, which I find a very, very sort of genuine, authentic way to capture the true way something sounds, right? So. Uh, after making a few of these ukulele videos, I realized, you know, I should go back to uh, my channel and uh, really see how I can take that to the next level. And I did. Um, it was this video that got me back into it. This was recorded back in my kitchen, horrible lighting, no prep. It was only part of a song. I'm glad I made it though, because it sort of reminded me like, hey, I have this great, um, this great channel I started. I have lots of followers who are giving me awesome, awesome comments and who are finding these videos very helpful. And that's super really encouraging to see. So I decided to sort of up things to the next level. I um, worked out a camera stand, a tripod, got my phone set up and uh, started again with a sort of proper full guitar lesson of an old favorite song. And then I was immediately just bitten by the bug and I went back to make another video and another one and another one. And these videos were coming at the rate that I learned songs naturally, which is about, I'd say every week or two or three, depending on the song, I'll get a song that I'm sort of learning to a place where I feel as good as I'm going to feel about it. And it's really, um, you know, it's fun for me to sort of challenge myself to, okay, if I was to make a video and sort of teach this, what would I want to do? What would I want to explain? So I started doing this just for all these songs and making these videos. But what's exciting to see at the end of this year is going back to that first video I made and uh, this last week of December, the most recent video I've made, I've made this many videos in that time. And um, I think that, you know, I took one little break in the summer for a few weeks, but otherwise I was staying with it pretty regularly and it feels great. Um, and I can say that for 2017, I wanna keep this up for the entire year. I don't wanna take any more super long breaks, especially you know, many year long breaks. It's just too long. Um, there's too many songs to be learning. It's sort of my pleasure to show you all, you know, how to play them and, and um, sort of spread this, the whatever musical insights I can gain from, from playing these songs. Yeah, that's the one thing I would take away from 2016 is I started making lessons again. And I can say that going forward, uh, the lessons will be 
coming regularly. I'm also going to be getting into some lessons that aren't songs. So if you have anything you want to learn with guitar as far as how to play a certain progression or a chord or just techniques or anything, let me know because I want to start extending beyond just uh, just songs as well. So and finally, I'd want to give a huge, huge thank you from the bottom of my heart to all you, my watchers, my viewers, my subscribers, my followers, who have watched these videos, who have left me the most kind comments ever. It, it just, it feels great to know that uh, these videos are, are helpful and um, are doing, reaching far more people than I ever thought would be possible. So once again, thank you. And especially those of you who have donated your hard earned money um, to my tip jar on my website, every dollar really, really counts and lets me know that you're out there and it really helps me make more of these lessons. So again, thank you very much. But otherwise, uh, that's it. Again, I wanted to make this video to capture where things are right now and look ahead to the future. So again, thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you're not already and uh, check out the rest of my stuff. But until next time, keep on rocking.